Right, I think we're back, break over. So, for those that did miss it, we did go through the, uh, where is it on here? Oh, there's so many events. Oh dear, hold on, let me just do that to make it a bit more compact. We did manage to complete the challenge, uh, the FNM at Home Challenger deck event. Granted, it is only two wins to get both cards. I managed to get myself a Nashiok and a Kai car out of that. I'm not about to complain. Gives me a deck to build around for the historic brawl event in the next couple of weeks. Well, I figured it only took about 40, 45 minutes to do that. And honestly, very tempted to just continue on with what we were doing last stream since we got interrupted with a server fail. Except this time, the uh, historic traditional. Yeah. We're actually going to try with the sideboard, see if we can actually play, like we can actually be any decent. Now this is the event version, there is an entry fee isn't there, which does give us the chance to earn some gold and earn some cards. So you know what, this next chunk of the stream, I'm just going to do this, either I somehow manage to look out and get five wins, or if I lose two times. So. And I've got plenty of gold. Granted, I'm saving up for that old Jace pet, but hey, if I can get two wins, I break even, so whatever, we'll try it. <laughs> and let us actually load it in. It is actually still letting us play our standard decks too, which is a little like, ooh. Oh well, yeah. Pirates in, and we're off. Uh, so let's see how we get on. Uh, glad I had that break though. I needed the bathroom and I needed the drink. Ironically, both ends of the process I needed seeing to. Ah uh, dear. Alright, let me actually get chat open at the same time. I just realise I've just been looking. No viewers currently, but hey, you never know. Hey, wow, that took forever to find someone. I guess not as many people play traditional. I, I Even I didn't know about the little button to turn that option on and off until like a few weeks ago. Choose if you will... Uh, why is it... Okay, you know, always play first. Unless I've got a very good reason. Also, I'm not keeping that hand. Goodness gracious. That's a million times better. So, yeah, definitely keeping that. What do I get rid of? I think it's just going to be the memorial, because if I'm going to draw into a black source of mana... Oh wait, no, no I just realised. Mm. Keep the memorial. Let's drop poisoner for now, because we can always have... Mm. Yeah, kite sail's too good not to just to just chuck away like that, so... Drop memorial. Hides what we're doing. Getting good poisoner might have been a mistake, but there's our black mana. It's okay. Now then. I really should have kept poison there. Oh, it's just riot the deck. Ugh. Oh well. Yeah, Zeta. Trample or haste? Well, counter or haste, even. Counter or haste. Right, he's going for haste. He's got a pair of two twos. I am not. No, I can take four for now. Okay, so let me just mess with the volume. I did look back at the audio for the last one, and the voices certainly were a bit loud. Let's at least alleviate that slightly. Alright, I can get shit back with that. I'm gonna wait and see if we can't block something with Brineborn. Sure, we might have to sack it off, but I've got Memorial to Folly. <laughs> okay. The Hexproof doesn't bother me. It's the fact that he's now got a pair of free frees. Attack of everything. Past the blockers. Gonna take five. Go to 11? Yeah. Should have really tried to get in the Brineborn there, but tell you what, let's see if we can't be active with it. 
Well, no, no, this guy. I'm not even, not even gonna waste my time trying to drag that out. They definitely had us. Let's go to sideboard. When it loads the screen, there we go. Sleep. Uh, don't think we'll need Calafay. Do we even need Storm Tamer? I don't know. Arch this Taker is going to be far too useful. Dress is kind of pointless. I'll take out Freebooter. You can put in Fiery Cannon because that's instant. Um, Target on creatures kind of pointless. Blink of an eye, no. Tried a couple Jace for the blockers the card draw. Actually, Angraph. Assuming we can last that long, we'll try it. Sometimes you gotta take the L. I'm definitely still gonna play first. Ugh. No. Before it took out Storm Tamer. Whatever, we'll keep that. Um. Kill Burn. It might just. Yeah. Yeah, no, oh no, Beckett. She's not going to do much for us when we've only got two pirates in hand. Screw it. Oh, let's get something out. If we've got the Storm Tamer, I might as well get the 1-1 one, one body out. Mm. Lana War. Okay. Do well, I'll take the two from the Blood Crypt in case we do need to kill something. I can just pop it. Guaranteed mana for next turn in case we need a cannonade. As long as it's your turn, Gruel Spellbreaker has X proof. So I can kill it next turn. Presumably, it's gonna come in with haste. Yeah, so he's gonna hit us with it, but then it's gonna die. I think I just I want to make sure. Destroy target creature CMC three or less. Yeah. Bah. And then we might as well have that into taps and get the damage in. that down now and then I'm gonna wait and see what he does. If he drops down a free free I can still kill it with the cannonade if a block of storm tamer. With a line of wall. Do a hold back. It's relying on me drawing a land though. Oh, okay. I wish I could block that. But no, questing beast is just bonkers. Block. Uh, tell you what. Let's just get rid of all of that. At least we don't have to worry about the Pal Collector. Hey, you know what? I will take that for days. If you get to stick around, I get a Questing Beast. Hit you for one. Hit 
Come on, show me what you've got with those two cards. Is it? Yeah, it's gonna be Bone Crusher. That's fine. I see your card, and I'll kill it with your card. Also, here's an island. Basically made that a two for one for us. What have you got next? Oh, oh, wonderful. Yeah, he's going for haste, isn't he? Yeah, so we're just taking five. I need an answer to that now. I will take that. At least keep that under control for a couple turns. You hitting? What are you doing? Two cards in hand. Green deck. Ghoul deck, to be fair, yeah. Still swing with Storm Tamer though. We are dead here, because that's going to untap next turn. Well, good game. I actually felt like I got a good lead there for a second until the Ceratops. Hit me. Hit me! Thank you. It's okay. It's okay. He's, he's fine. He's got a click on him and he's happy. Well, there's one loss. <laughs> you lose some. You lose some. As occasionally you'll win one. Oh well. You know what, it, depending on how quick I lose on this, I might give that another shot. Depends if I, if I lose this one immediately too. But hey, that's what you get for forcing yourself into a very low support tribe like pirates rather than just gruel smashy which has been a thing since 93. Right, they get the choice between first or second. They're probably going to go first. Yeah. And you know what? I really like that hand, so I'm going to keep that. Yeah, Island, Storm Tamer, take two from Blood Crypt, see what they've got. Mana open for counter spell. Green. Dinosaurs? Dinosaurs, it seems. Unless the commune is for something else entirely. It's just top five for a land or a dinosaur. And he chose the land. And there's the dinosaur. But yeah, there we go. Land of War. Which means... It might be more useful. Keeping up the mana. For a counter spell. I doubt he's not got many non-creatures in his hand. Mountain. Now is it Gruul or Naya? There's the card I was expecting. No. Well, Animal Elf is not a 2 2. That also might mean he has no dinosaurs in hand. Unless they're just expensive. I could find out. Well, I'm gonna Fathom Fleet. Get the mana for Siren to keep him protected. Then next turn, drop a freebooter. See if he's got any more savage storm siding in there. From land war to land war. Ooh. No, let's have a peek. What you got? Pearl land. Ripjaw Raptor is relevant. That's a 4 5 I can't really easily deal with. You know what? I could still take out Lanamore, but he'll draw a card. 
So let's just hit with a flyer for now. If I'm really desperate, I could always just triple block the Ripjaw. That's if I'm really desperate. More land! Oh boy, he is... I could take four. He is uh, not very lucky right now. Thank you. Yeah, attack all out. See if I can't bait a rip jaw. Double block the Fathom Fleet. That's fine. I made two tokens out of him. Dinosaur. Swing with Ripjaw. Have a card. I'll trade you your Ripjaw's life for a card. Drove the Mighty. Not bad. Uh, okay, yeah. That's very important sequencing there. So I'm literally just attacking with flyers right now, and you just keep giving me more flyers. Next turn. I'm going to at least block each of those. Yeah, Marauding Raptor, very good. For if he's got a lot of enrage, uh, which he does. So now I'll deal one damage to that, you'll get to- oh, two damage even. Pumps that up. I actually kind of want to play something like this, it seems fun. Just attacking with the Marauding. It's too good. It makes his creatures cheaper, and it enables his enrage, so it can die. Still, that Fathom Fleet Captain's technically killed two Land of Wars and a Marauding Raptor, so kudos. Swing of Flyers. Pretend we don't have anything. Yeah, sure. It's another enraged trigger. I forgot Raging Sword 2 for is a card. I can take five. Tyrant Scorn, very good. Now then, we only cast two of these with the amount of black. So, we do it at instant speed. What else have you got coming out? Stop you getting more land. And take you through damage. That's fine. Everybody dead. Who needs a board wipe? I mean, I really do. Nothing to see. We're both incredibly out of cards. Communing with our 20 cards. Ugh. Yeah, for us are done. I can't gain life. So, two to that. I'll block you. Oh, that has menace menace too. Uh, okay. Oh, wait, no. I am just dead here. Yeah, I've played. Uh, Alright, you know what? I got stomped on. Quite early as well, he got that savage stomp like three times in the early game. Right. The gates are going in. But can he use bravado? Let's go down to Caliphate. Let's go with a bravado too, I reckon.
Yeah, let's go down the Bravado, still have a space open. You know what, let's just go, let's just go down all Calafay. Fiery Cannonade ain't going to do anything for sleep, though, on the other hand. I can still hear the fox. Um, let's throw in a Jace. Go on. See how that goes. They're still sideboarding. We're playing a very Ixalan set, block set type of deck. I'm definitely gonna go first. Uh, mm, why is that tempting? I don't like the amount of shock lands, but the other cards, screw it. Those early turns, drovers, communes, and maybe stomps and elves. Yeah, there's the elf. Now. See if he's got any stomps in hand. No. But, ranging raptors, marauding raptor, drover. So next turn's probably gonna be land, drover. Yeah. The driver first. Not too fair, yeah. Now oh, then, I think I might actually lose. Put my sister by my side. I do not fear the unknown. I will learn what nobody yet knows. Drop the steam vents. I don't want to take too much damage from land right now. Uh hold back attacks. Yeah, go get the land. Rory Graptor is just really good in this. Jesus. I like it. And they're just sending the wall. Oh, it's all going at them. Go on. I'll slow down the game a little bit. Roman, help! Speaking of planeswalkers, we're apparently playing a bunch of them. I'm always a step ahead. Let us loot. Mm, a quest of mystery. I think we're gonna need blue more than anything right now. I'm gonna hold that back as a blocker. So, do we make another blocker? Could do. Let's look at the board. So, we make a 2 2. He's definitely just not gonna attack with that, but he'd attack with anything else. He'd probably be able to just kill off Jace. But probably the same if it went to 4. Yeah, screw it. Let's make a body. Just because it isn't real doesn't mean it won't kill you. Keep his attention on the planeswalkers away from us for a moment. Oh, he's ramping. Oh, I don't like that. Though they might kill the raptors. No, it did not. No. Uh... So I feel like Cannonade could have been a good choice. Oh well, I'm learning. See so ya, yeah, Range of Jace. So, that Rowan is those two. Jace is just that. I'll kill it off. You can have you can have Will and Rowan. Counter spells always nice. 
always an answer. Play entirely at instant speed. I'll at least have a free two, which could kill things. Meh. Mm -hmm. Now that he's risking killing a lot of his stuff there. But at the same time, I don't like it. It's too many triggers. You can pay the four, but I get a counter. So make your decision, buddy. and go to nine. No, not with the amount he's got on board. Five, eight, two, ten. Even if he does drop another dinosaur. Never mind, we're just dead. We. You know what? We'll do this again. And if next time it just gives us a bunch of green smashy things, I think I need to reconsider my deck construction. Well. I got a bunch of chaff. Wunderbar. Attempt two. He thinks my sideboard needs more kill spells. Because currently I only have six, and one of them doesn't really do anything against Trample with the Poisoner. The other doesn't hit anything that costs four or more. Which is an issue. So. Need to consider what would be good. Maybe Bounce. Let me play first. No. Bunch of black cards and no black mana. Uh, all my colours, I can drop Beckett. How much does it hurt? Every time I always put Beckett away. It's probably telling me I probably shouldn't have her in the deck, but I want to have fun. Boreal Great. It's at another green deck. Tell you what. Really have no choice but to plop that down. Because these weren't going to get cast anyway. Whatever's coming out. Grave Spiral. At least I know what his turn is. And you can't really attack with your Boreal Grazer. Now then. Not like I'm going to get the token anyway, so we'll just have a completely instant speed hand. We'll decide what we need. No. No to fairy. You go bye bye. You want to hit me for zero? No? Oh, crazy. Rinse, repeat. Oh, he's got red in there too. This is a fire's deck? Elvish Rejuvenator. You go find land. Field of the Dead. I shouldn't have done that. Well, here's a Brineborn. Here's a Watery Grave. And I'm just going to swing for damage. Replace himself. Kill the Rejuvenator. And then play reactively again. Here comes that land. Again? No. No to fairies. It's not 
got enough land of different names, that's a relief. At least gets rid of the grazer. Oh no, he's just taking the five. Okay. Gross spiral, can't really do anything about that. Rejuvenator. I missed it. Tell me, do you actually plan on doing anything? Because I've only taken damage from my own land. And right now, it's not looking amazing for you. Tell you what, I'm going to spite you. Gets to live. Hope you don't have a board white. No, but you are. One, two, three, four, five, six. Still not enough of them zombies. There's that board white. That was a lot louder than expected. Alright, show me what you got. Escape shift. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh god. You were planning on doing a lot there, weren't you? So we could play the 7-7. Seven seven. It doesn't have reach. Speaking of. Never mind. That was just another board wipe. Uh don't do this to me. Alright, we'll give it a couple of turns. I almost had it there, jeez. Well, the gates are definitely going in. Yeah. Probably the sleeps too, in case. Alright. Next, uh... Right, yeah, I'll leave that up as a blocker and we'll see what he does. Honestly, I just want to see what his deck does. You gonna escape shift? Cannonade is also definitely going in, now that I think about it. He's not doing it, so we are dead. But he is just going for maximum land drops. So negate definitely, sleep definitely, cannonade definitely. So I need to take out seven. He's not really targeting us. I don't think, no, he's just got board wipes. That's what the negates are for too. Real science can stay in. Hostage takers good against the realm cloak giant just in case. Back it out. As much as I hate to say it. Brian Bourne really sped up a clock. Tyrant scorn. I don't really think we need it. Sure, we could bounce something in response to a board wipe, but it's not going to do anything for us. Is the duress worth it? I think so. So poison it, I don't really think we need either. Just need to get rid of one card. I'll just drop a Storm Tamer because he isn't really targeting our things either, but it's nice having the low drops. I might actually try and build a, you know, a real historic deck at some point. Rather than just my dinky tribe. Okay. Um. Plenty of counter and lockdown. Sure, we'll keep that.
How are you doing, little guy? You happy? Yeah. Steam vents. Don't want to take the damage. Really no point to taking the damage. Abor oh no, a boreal. And then we'll hold that up. You could always drop it a brine born. Uncle Thicket. Okay. He's just going for the multiple names, isn't he? It's a nice choice for Ireland too. Noah Bradley. And a grow spiral. Nothing we really well, it's not really worth a counter spell. He's certainly getting those multiple names for land. Alright, get these whilst they're doing something. Euro is definitely worth countering. Especially when it gets all as a counter. Kind of confusing, but those are called the same thing. Rinse, repeat. It seems like a deck that would very much die to anyone playing something more aggressive than us. And Teferi can also go off. Use the lookout's dispersal whilst they're still useful. Save another gate for later in the game. We just really need to draw some black mana. Non creature spell, goodbye. Uh, so that's a note to the, the the black miner, is it? Okay, we'll hit you for five, down to six. And then we got to sleep ready in case he does go off. It's down to four, so he's confident. Hydroid Crasis will do it. There's the black miner we were after. So. Options. Hostage taker gets us a body. And we'll get that out of the way. And if he does get rid of the hostage taker, it just die dies. Yeah, we'll save sleep in case it doesn't work and he gets the zombies out. But at the same time, we can also just cast it and gain life and draw cards. Just in case something's about to happen. There's our something. Lonely Sandbar. Didn't escape. He go bye-bye. Then he's not got enough... Oh, he's now got the... Man. No, he doesn't. Shatter the sky. I get a card! Happy days. Yeah, I don't know why it played the animation. Hydrocrasis just goes pop. Pay the two. Drop both of you. And hold back for Brian Bourne in case we can squeeze that in to kill him. You can get an Uro out, but we've got Menace. We've also got Sleep. It's a lot of land. Two cards. Does he? Realm Cloak Giant. Sure. Anything else? Is this an Oro? It's an Oro. He had just enough to escape. I think we got this. Sleep to lock it down for a couple turns. He's gonna be forced to cast the other one. Oh, he's going up a high rate. Oh! Alright. Oh, you're not doing anything for one green? No. 
Right. Okay. I've not really got any answers. I can't attack into that. But I can maybe kill an Uro between the Fiery Cannonade and the Bravado. Cycling a Thicket. Game free life. Go spiral. It's a good one to get. No response. Bravado. So we're killing him. anything. So he knows he's killing him. Oh. Okay. So he's just straight up tapped. Okay. So we're just taking the eight. X is four. Hydro Crisis is just a bonkers card. I'm surprised he's not actually got that field of the dead yet. He's certainly trying to get to it. 30 cards left in deck. I'm gonna show off. I'm not with this. I'm getting another counter on him. Memorial to Folly though. Not not fast enough. Just kill it. Trade in your Crassus for it. Don't know why you double blocked. Also don't know why the animation played like that. You're gonna kill me the boring way? Yeah, you're gonna kill me the boring way. Hey, you finally got a field! Alright. Ugh, so... Grindy decks and big green decks. Not in our favor. <laughs> what is in our favor? Control? <laughs> Going by what happened last day. Last stream, last day, last stream, control, if we draw the kite sails in our favour, but not much else. Whatever, I have a pirate deck. It is now, well, it, it literally just takes around about 30 seconds, and Lady Star. Another day, another fibble fit. Waiting for your opponent to choose. Okay. What's our hand? Pure disruption. I'll keep it. No, they went second. Someone on control? Someone on green. Why is everyone on green? In a goose. Bank Lyoko's band. Well, let's just find out what you do have. The mono green stumpy deck. Great. Alright. We'll take the season of growth. I got the poison it. For something. The goose can block me all day if it likes. I don't care. Back it. Right, so that requires a second of food for the mana. You can easily get the fall. 
was either going to be the Night Pack or the Questing Beast. Probably the Questing Beast. It's a Dire Fleet. Doesn't do much in this instance. But Dire Fleet plus Fathom Fleet Captain is always a fun combo. And no attacks. Make it a food. Popping an egg. Honking. Whatever you want to call that. He's thinking which creature's best. Does he hold back? with the Howler, or does he just go in with the Questing Beast, or does he have something that works with that Evolution Sage? Because those land drops prolif proliferating, there's gonna be 1-1 one -one counters in there somewhere. Questing Beast it is, alright then. I'll take the fall. I don't have a choice. Currently, neither do you. Give me that. Now maybe we should just put more hostage takers in this. They save my ass constantly. Fun thing I learned of hostage taker as well. If you Steal something like this that has an adventure, you can cast the adventure. And then the creature then goes to exile, but not under the hostage taker. So you can still then cast the creature even if they get rid of the hostage taker. Which, honestly, that sounds like a hell of a lot of fun. Right, well, looks like we're getting rid of the night pack howler. Let's do that. Another land. Which means he's not got anything that works with the Evolution Sage. He gets a wolf. Right, 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 right. I really feel like... If we draw this out long enough, I could start stealing things with Beckett. I want to have a look at that hand. He can respond. It could just be the food. Circuitous root. Let go bye bye. This is not a house where we ramp. Are you trying to make a wolf army to deal with us? Are you just trying to make blockers? No, you're taking the four again. Okay. And our turn. Need the food, yeah. Yeah, he's doing it for the life. So it's like we only hit him for one now. We just cost him most of his mana. Come on. Going to attacks. Make it a wolf. I'm gonna bring it a poisoner. Okay, I feel like this is where we might be able to start stealing more things. Definitely attacking with you, and you. Oh, 
Hus is taking you've done your job. How do you block? Token blocking a hostage taker, yeah? Completely understandable. We're doing it! We're taking shit! Three pirates hit. Becca Brass. You make food. You gonna eat the food? I'm taking that knife pack out. The knife pack ambusher. Give me that. Because that also killed that token. Because it had two damage marked on it, and it lost the plus one plus one. Pelt collector. <laughs> Evolution sage. You need the blockers. A boreal grazer. You know what? That worked out fairly nicely. To where I'm just... I clicked the wrong button. I was going to cancel attacks. I was going to swing out. Screw it. We'll toy with him a little bit. Uh-huh. You gonna make food? No, you've not got enough mana. We'll pass. Yeah? Chuck that down for good measure. No hand! Just a massive board. Yeah. Accidentally toyed with him. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hey, sideboard sleep is just going in. Did he really target anything? I don't feel like he did. But he could have something sideboard. And a couple cannonade. So, as much as Becca Brass helped with that, I don't think we need her. I could probably drop a couple of Calife and we'll see what Angraf can do for us. I like that match though, I might clip that one. It's our first win, so you know, <laughs> revel in it. Ugh, I immediately hate that. We can go away. That's not great either. This is where we die. Right, we're keeping five. Calife. And I kind of like everything else. I don't want to put a sleep to the 
We might need it. A bit of brine bone to the bottom. We got the two blue, we got the black, we got all of our colours. There's a goose. We'll take the two, storm tame Just for the body. We know he's got seasons of growth in the circuitous route. But that's literally all freebooters took last game. So if we do lose this one, that might be an out. The ramp, no. I like how we got a hostage taker. That could be very useful. Probably around about now. You gonna show the questing beasts? No? No. We're gonna hold back our aggression. Fair enough. Something for free mana? No. We can enter tapped. And I could take two more damage, that's fine. But then I've got all the mana I ever need. Let me make a food. You're holding stuff back, aren't you? You're playing us like we're a control deck. But if they're too scared to sandbag, they're too scared to really play proactively. Speaking of, there's the root. Two basics and all gates. Sure. was forged in battle <laughs> and many training sessions just in case for Do some reason they have something that targets us I can hit for free and I can't kill and or steal if you don't play it what are you doing with so much mana It's like, what? Oh, the goose ain't tapping for anything right now. It's like six mana? Don't tell me it's a ceratops. I'm really fed up with ceratopses. I like dinosaurs, I don't want to hate one. Ooh. Voracious Hydra, you're hitting something. Well, you're doubling your counters. Well, that's gonna die anyway. And a cruise. Okay. Nothing to attack with. Tell you what, let us loot. Let me synthesize the facts. An angra. I think it's... I don't really want to discard any of this. We discard Poisoner. Play the Hostage Taker. Nab ourselves a Hydra. Play the Land and Pass. Play it for free and have it come in as a 6 7. Ooh. You, I don't like. I'm a bit higher now. I'll take the damage. So, two index. One, so, if we can have XP4. Double the amount to make it an 8 9. Oh, I could use it to kill the night pack out and ambush her. Yeah, they kind of just played into that, didn't they? Is 
is a full five, yeah, so. Yum. Boost up the hostage taker. Put your heart behind every attack. We might kill something, or we just get four damage in. We get four damage in. Past turn. You can make a food, or you can eat a food. I'm not going to do either. Okay. Honestly, we just got lucky drawing the hostage takers both of these games. I won't lie. That's why I kind of want to put a third in. <laughs> oh, do not like you. We're gonna go for Rowan. Goose is gonna go for Rowan. That doesn't get rid of them. I keep calling them Rowan when it's Will and Rowan. You know what? You can have them. Cannonade, sleep, or angraph. All very nice options to have. So angraph, if I'm minus three, gain target, gains haste, untap it, sack it if it costs three or less. That definitely doesn't. Sleep, I think we sleep. Because if he does have another one of them, we can angraph it, slap him. In fact, no. He didn't have the mana for it because I tapped it. <laughs> Miss it though, is a thing. Together, we will prevail. Am I going to steal a land? You know, I might. Unless you just really want two mana. Harness the elements. Yeah, they went for the Rebecca Gay one. So, we got taste at least. But yeah, this is, that's just the uh, forest they had for the land. Again, all in good taste. Let's have an angraph. <laughs> Please run. A chase stokes the forge. Ah, you'll be nothing but slag when I'm done with you. Why can you respond? What are you doing? Are you holding down control? Or does green actually have instant speed interaction at the moment? Veil of Summer was banned, right? Your crew for my freedom. freedom. <laughs> A fair price. And then we hit him. I don't even care about Nissa. Let's go for face. No blocks. Any spells for one green. This gives you the good game. Oof! Well fought. That was good. So, hostage take is an MVP. And we still have not cast <laughs> enough red spells or green spells, despite we've stolen so many for our daily. Well, he's getting some of the gold back. Let's see how long we can force this! That was good though, that was good. I did like the look of that deck. Mono Green Stompy does not get enough credit as just a deck. Let's just check my frames. I've not actually dropped any yet. Sweet. Alright, another 30 seconds. 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Oh, no, not straight away. It's taking a little longer to find someone. Take a lot longer to find someone. Well, I can see that I'm still talking to an empty room. But, hey, at least this can go up on YouTube. Hamster Mansion. Do I need to call the RSPCA on you? Eh, um, you know what? I kind of like that. Then again, I see Narset sleeves into the fairy. So 
Screw it. We'll judge a book by its cover. Ugh. I don't really want to go down to five. Screw it. We'll drop a calife. White. Mono white life gain. I see your 1-1. One, one. I, I present to you all 1-1. One, one. At least Die Fleet Poison is going to be useful here. Access. Gain the one. Play reactively with poison, we might be able to kill a demigod. So who took down Daxos, you know, champion of the sun, demigod? There's this lady with a arm cannon. Don't ask. If you say so. A splendid angel, though. I remember you being mean. Right, well, we can't attack into that. Might as well just get one of these out. What do you do again? At the end of the end step, if you gain five more life, make a 4-4. Four, four. And for six mana, plus two, plus two, and lifelink. Uh, attacking with both. I'll get rid of the Sarah Ascendant. You can gain the life all you want. I, I don't want that thing being like a... Uh, Soul sister, soul sister. All right, all right. Glad I got rid of Daxos. Oh, don't do that to me. This Fiji Storm team is apparently have the life. You were gonna get it anyway. Play a creature. Hit me with Sarah Ascendant. No blocks. Another resplendent angel. This block we don't like to see. I don't think we have this one. Not when we're getting so screwed on land. Then again, we might be able to draw this out. Wait, I'll block one. Still a slight chance. It's small, but it's there. If I can get off a hostage taker. I just need one land. I don't care what colour it is. Attacking with the Soul Warden too? Six, seven, eight, nine. It put me to one. Go to four. It's tempting to try and kill the soul sister. Oh, and it's not just the soul sister, it's the Sarah Ascendant. Ooh, okay. Well, that'll die if I try and kill something important. Screw it. I'll get rid of the snowball before it's too big. I am dead here. I got the land I wanted. Far. Far too late. Yeah. Yeah, popping that for that is. A very good point. Well. Sideboard. Again, I want to say sleep. I know I put it in every time. But <laughs> it's worked. <laughs> Don't think Kite Sail is doing anything for us in this moment. Or oh, say blink of an eye. Very cannonade. Royal Scions aren't doing much for us right now either. But an Angraf. Drop a Caliphate, put in the other Angraf. But just they're not targeting us. 
anything else I feel I need other than the other half of my sideboard. Uh, blink of an eye, bounce, it is card draw, but it's four mana card draw, and you all just saw how much I was struggling to draw that fourth land. So, mana white life gain, let's see how we go. If we lose here, that'll be the last one for tonight. That's... I don't like sitting around for turns though. But the hostage taker, if he doesn't have... If he doesn't have it. Crap. Alright. Drop Beckett. Tyrant Scorn can take out most of his deck. Speaking of most of his deck. Right. Take the two. And then we'll see what he's bringing in next turn. Yeah, okay. You get rid of my thing, I get rid of your thing. Heliod. Oh, wonderful. I guess I'll hit you. When this leaves a battlefield, I get a dinosaur. Kind of makes me wish to put in Blinky for Nine now. Conclave. Now he's got devotion increased as well. One, two, three. Okay, he needs five for Heliod. Devotion is less than five. Yeah, we've got the sleep ready for that at least. Go nuts! Resplendent. There's the devotion. He can in fact hit us for five because this is a sorcery. Anything else? No. Betty buys. Marvindale. Jace. A manip ah! Oh, look at that. It's so sad to watch you fight yourself. You might be distracted. I can at least block Heliod. He's probably going to send the human at Jace. Probably going to send more of it, Jace, actually, just to be sure I don't block it. Heliod at me, Angel at me. Oh, okay, he's just sending everything at me. I don't want to take eight, so I'll take three. Plus some big five, and you're making an angel. I don't think I have this. He's snowballing far too much right now. Hostage taken, though. I could have a Heliod. Doesn't mean anything, but I can have a Heliod. It's a matter of give and take. Well, at least he won't have a Heliod. A Johnny's Pride Mate! Oh. Wonderful. Yeah. I think we just need better removal for the deck. Alright, well, I'm going to work on that off stream. But we put in a couple good hours today. So, let's claim what I got. 500 gold and cultivating curse <laughs> suitable. Damping sphere is pretty nice, actually. I might 
I might actually. Mm. Yeah, and Legion Lieutenant. Yeah. Well, that was a journey. I still haven't beat my dailies, but again, I'm gonna do that off stream. I'm gonna relax a bit now. I'm gonna probably play a bit of standard or something. But yeah, thank you all for joining in. I say, as I see my view count still at zero. Uh, whatever. Early days. But yeah, thank you for anyone who popped in. Uh, thank you for anyone watching on YouTube. Good night.